Good morning, good morning. It's freezing out there. Let me see if I can do this. You can't really see. See the weight? It's absolutely freezing. My hair's still a wee bit wet. I was at my swimming today. I went my, up my swimming today. Um, why is it not coming up? The sound is down. I think it's going to snow. There we go. That's us now. The found is now. I've got new phone chargers coming today as well with long wires so I can juice these up um, properly. Because it doesn't, this for some reason doesn't charge it or anything. So there we are. So let's see how long my battery lasts today. There we go. Let me get a live chat up. Good morning, good morning. It is bitterly cold outside. The roads are white. Good morning, golfer girl. Good morning to you. Well, I'm feeling a bit better today. Feeling a bit better. My neck's a bit better as well. It's still pretty sore, but it's I can I can move it although it's sore. Edge of ASMR, good morning to you. Good morning, good morning. Liana, good morning. Yes, I was up my swimming. I only done twenty six lengths, so you know I usually, I usually do like fifty or a hundred, but we're only allowed in for an hour, and there was no cold, there was no hot water, there was no hot, so I couldn't even go for my nice shower because I usually go for a beautiful shower afterwards because it's a big, it's got a big head. This shower and you go in and it's just wonderful, so I couldn't go for my shower afterwards. So I had to wait until I came home to do my hair. So it's still a bit damp, but anyway. But it was nice. It was nice getting up the swimming. But you've got we've got to book in again. Um, we've got to book in, and as I say, we're only allowed an hour, and that's to do everything. But it was nice anyway getting back up. But it was a wee bit sad because when I, my my drive was different this morning because there was no lovely Christmas lights everywhere. See, like a few weeks ago when I was driving up, there was lots of beautiful displays, lights and stuff like that. Today there wasn't. Everybody's took their stuff down. So it was a wee bit sad that. I felt a bit sad that we weren't lovely twinkling lights. But I, but I managed to do my swim and it was nice. It was nice getting into my swim. So I've booked in again for the rest of the week and then up till next Tuesday. Um, because you're only allowed to book a week in advance. So it's a terrible carry-on that we've got here. Terrible cut. I think it's because we're only allowed, but we've got to stay distance, like a meter or two meters or something apart from people again. That's what we've got to do here in Scotland. But we're, we're, we're all going to get the dreaded layer game. That's what's going to happen. And my booster, my arm's still a wee bit sore, but it's it's all it's all right. I mean, I, I never, I've never, I've never had any like symptoms with the, the first two. Jags or this one. Let me see if the if the arm. I mean, it's all right. It's just not bothering me. <coughs> but it was nice seeing my regular people up the swimming as well. So I said happy. There was a week. There's a, a girl that I, I talked to every morning. She was near there, but she works um, with children. So I don't know. And it opens at seven. We're usually there at six. Oh, Sky, my, <whistles> my goodness, Sky, I had no idea. How are you feeling? Oh, my goodness. How are you feeling? What happened? Tell us what happened. That doesn't sound like a fun Monday night. That doesn't sound fun at all. I'm glad you're okay though, and we miss you. We always miss you. I, I miss these all, but I know that some people uh, watch on catch up, so that's. He's are still here, even though if he's watch up and catch up, I still love you. Hope you know that. See, I don't even know where your appendix is. I, I have no idea where you're about. I know it's like in your belly or something like that, round about that area, but I don't know. See, when I've got sore bits and bobs, I have no idea what it is. Oh, guys, listen. <laughs> Shane, no, I've not seen him. 
There's been a few drunken lies. It's a Saturday, isn't it? And Saturdays, that's what I like to do. And Saturdays, I like to get drunk and talk to strangers online. <whistles> <laughs> Mama Spoon ASMR, good morning to you. Thank you so much for coming in to talk to me. Yeah, the, 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 the drunken live. I mean, we've got to say what one, what, what one. <laughs> Which one of the drunken lives? Saturday, that's what I do. I like to do that on a Saturday. Everybody knows what to expect, though. Do you know what I mean? If they come into my life on a Saturday, they know it's not going to be a live like this. And it usually ends me telling everybody how much I love them and stuff like that. Do you know what I mean? I love you more than a friend. No, that's what that all comes out my mouth when I've had a wee drink, because I'm a loving person. I've got lots of love to give. <laughs> uh, listen, right... Is anybody into trials and crime documentaries, etc., etc.? Right, I am. Um, and I've watched a lot of trials, right? I've watched on a, on a channel called Law and Crime. See, if you've nothing to do today, I'd like you to go and listen to this, if you can stomach it. Right, wait a minute, tell you what this guy says. Oh, my goodness. Oh my goodness, Sky, going to be careful, watch yourself. That sounds terrible. Is it, have you still got the, is the pain still there? See if you're still having pain, go, go back, go straight back and say, look, you're still having terrible pain and you need someone to see. Everybody's frightened to go to the hospital now because the hospitals here are chock-a-block, they say, um, full with people with the... the the virus. See if you're still in pain, Sky, go back and say, look, I'm still in a lot of pain. Um, I need someone to see me or more tests done or something like that, just because you've not got a fever. I mean, you can have things wrong with you and you, you don't necessarily need a fever for it. Do you know, so, sometimes I wonder if I'm a better doctor than actual doctors. I'm turning into a better lawyer, by the way. I'm turning into a good lawyer. I'm going to object, object at that statement. I'm going to tell you about this trial. I'd like you to watch. Good, Sky. I'm glad that they're going to run tests. You need to let me know how you get on. I'll be thinking about you. Right, Law and Crime Channel. If you can stomach um, trials like this. There's going to be a lot of things I can't say here, right? But use your imagination. It just started yesterday. This trial's meant to last three weeks, right? And it's... I can say dismembered, can't I? Right, this boy done that to his parents. Right, we'll get that out the road. This boy said that he was um, a scuba diving expert, right? This boy was a scuba diving expert. Good morning, Charo. Is it Charo or Carol? Charo, good morning. I'm sorry I can't pronounce your name properly. I'm, te I'm terrible at reading. Right, so this boy is pretending that he's a scuba diving expert, right? Not only that, but he's he's going to university or something like that. He's doing accounting. His dad, his dad is an accountant and makes a good wage. Do you know? I mean, they're not short of a buck or two. They're quite they're quite rich. They've got a cabin and all this stuff, you know, a boat and all that. They've got all that. So anyway, this boy is doing accounting in university. He's meant to be getting money through the university, but. There's no money coming in. They're like, where's the money? There's no money coming in. That's weird. And the dad said, how's there no money? And he says, they owe me that much money. They owe me that much money. It should be happening soon. Right? So then, guess what? SpaceX, SpaceX, Elon Musk, decide, do you know what? He's the kind of guy that we're after down here. You know, we're, we're looking for a guy like that in SpaceX. So... There he is, he's telling all his friends, look at me, I'm, I'm in, I've, I've got a job in SpaceX now, isn't that I'm so absolutely amazing? You know, I'm, I've got a job in SpaceX. I'll read all the statements, now, uh, comments in a minute, I need to get this out. Right, so, that was him, everybody was going, that's great son, you're, you're doing fantastic, SpaceX, that's a, that's a brilliant job that, eh? that's, that's a brilliant job. So, anyway, 
nae money still came in, there was nae money ever coming in, so the dad thought to himself, do you know what, I'm going to phone this university and pretend I'm my son, right, because he knew, knows all his son's details, etc. So there he is, he phones, he phones the university and says, my name, I can't mind the boy's name, this is me, uh, it's just to see about where, where I'm getting my money. And they said, what money? What, what money are you talking about? He said, the, I've been going to this university. They said, hold on a minute. So they come back and they went, we don't have you on record. Right? And he says, I'm in so-and-so's class, right? One of the lecturers that the boy's been telling his dad. There's no such lecturer here. Right? So the dad was on to him that that was a lie. Right? He wasn't going to university at all. So he sends his son a text saying, we need to have a talk here. We need, I phoned the school. I spoke to someone. Um, we, need, we need to have a wee talk about this, right? So it turns out, not only did they lie about the university thing, he'd never scuba dived in his life. Never scuba dived. Right? Never scuba dived. Um, also, SpaceX didn't want him. That was a lie as well. He was, I'm, I'm more an astronaut than this boy. I'm more than that, you know. I'm more an astronaut than him. SpaceX didn't want him at all. Not only that, he was saying that he fell down the stairs and he went to the doctor and the doctor said that he had um, bleeding of the brain and all this kind of stuff. And he's going to put his, do you know, better call Saul, I think that's where, who he went to. He's going to put me a neck brace on this boy with neck brace. This is what the doctor told me, I've got to wear this neck brace. No, he'd never been to a doctor, he hadn't even fa he fell down the stairs. Right, so it's a web of lies, a web of lies, right, web of lies. Oh, this is going on. So anyway... The dad, he's waiting on his dad, he's waiting on his dad, and he, he does his dad in, does his dad in, right, his, his dad's done in. And then he sends his mum a wee, now this got me, he sends his mum a wee text saying, Mum, can you get me some cream soda juice out the shop? And the mum sends back, of course, son, I'll bring you some cream soda, right? Mum goes home, mum ends up the same as dad, done in. He does the two of them in, two of them are done in. Right, this is allegedly because the court case is going on, right? But I'm, I'm going to get into it all. So, there he is. He's, 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 he's wondering, what the hell am I going to do? I've got mum and dad both here, you know, done in. Uh, how am I going to get rid of mum and dad? Do you know what? He had a fireplace in his house. Mm -hmm. A fireplace. And a measuring tape and some saws, right? So, you can imagine what happened there. You know what happened there, right? Things happened there. Lots of stuff happened there. And it ended up that if... It was in July as well. It was July. So in the USA in July, it's pretty warm. Do you know what I mean? You don't need a fireplace on. This fireplace, the neighbours said, this fireplace was burning hot, right, for, for a long, long time. Flickering heat. And one of the neighbours even said there was a smell in the air as if there was um, a pork roast or something going on, right? We, we're on the side chat, walking at this. We're on the we can't get out of this. Yes, mum and dad's head. That's where their head was. Beth, good morning to you. Good morning. So anyway, he's realised that you can't really get rid of mum and dad that way. It's not working. He's going to need a, a plan B. He's going to need a plan B, this boy. So a few days prior, his girlfriend knew a couple that had a farm, right? He didn't know these people, but the girlfriend knew them. So they went to this farm, right? They went away to this farm. And they had a pool, so they said, Can we use your pool? And they bother it, and you get. So they played about in the pool, and then they were leaving. Thanks very much, and all that. And the, the people of the farm are going, Come again and see us, and all the rest of it, right? So the next day, after he'd done this with mum and dad, then he goes to this farm to the people he doesn't know. Remember me, I was here yesterday or the day before with my girlfriend. Can I use your pool? And the woman in the farm thought, That's weird. That's weird that he wants to... And she said, aye, okay, son, aye, you can, you can use the pool, use the pool. Half an hour later, she goes down. The pool hadn't been used. The, the cover was still on the pool or something, right? Nothing was... Nobody was in the pool. But she did notice his truck in the bushes. His truck was in the bushes. Right? So she thought, that's weird. Why is his truck in the bushes? Right? We, we, we know where the bus is going. So she w w was telling the police this. I he had his truck over there. His truck was over there in the bushes, right? So away they go. 
the woman that owns the farm and the police, things, I'm sure maybe the truck was over there. Before they could get to the place, guess what was in the bushes? Vultures. Vultures were in the bushes. Vultures. So they go in and all they find dad's torso. That's all they find in the bushes. That's the only bit of dad that they could find was his torso in these bushes, right, that the boy was in. So the girlfriend goes in for questioning and is talking and she's she's open and honest. She, she's like an open book. She doesn't know nothing about what's been going on. But she said to the police, me and my boyfriend, we've got this app on our phone that I know where he is and he knows where I am all the time. I don't know what kind of app this is, right? But it's like, like oh, there he's at Asda or something like that. Oh, there he's driving down the road. So they've got an app. So on said day, she said it was really funny because... He was at this riverside, right? At this riverside, and I don't know what he was doing at the river. I don't know what he was doing at the river. Well, they go to the river. Guess what they find at the river? Mum's legs. That's it. That's all the mum they ever find. They don't find any more of mum. That's it. That's all they find is mum's legs at the river. And um, when they're... Uh, that was it, they knew, right, we, right, we need to get this guy in. So they get the guy in, so they start look, having a look about the house and stuff like that, right? They start looking about the house. And in the fireplace, there's new logs in the fireplace, new logs. But there's this white stone thing, this white, this thing that's, that's they're looking at, and it's white and it's like stone or something like that. Well, they take it to the forensic, yes, it's a bit of skull, a bit of skull that they find in the fireplace, that's what they find in the fireplace. Um, apparently on the will, they, they were like, um, they they'd, they'd an older brother as well, but the two of them were going to get half of whatever mum and dad had, and it was, like, it was going into about a million, about a million dollars, or the rest of it. So, we're all watching this, the, the regulars, right, that watch the Lone Crime channel, we're, we're, we're on the, the side chat going, what was next? What is next? You know what I mean? Oh, here, a, a, an important point. The fireplace, right? The fire, no, how when he was, he had the, the heads in the fireplace. Fat was running out, the heads, and ignited, right? And it became a fire that was erupting like that. The fire was erupting. So what did he do? He chopped water over it. And you know what happens when you throw water over an oily fire? Whoosh! Fires up like that so hot that it blows out panes of glass. Panes of glass are blown out this fireplace in July, I mean, add, in July. <laughs> Sky, I know. So we're on it, we, we cannot get over it. This is day, This was just yesterday on the Law and Crime channel, right? It's going to last three weeks, this trial. Wait until tell you his lawyer, right? His lawyer comes on, right? This is a, this is a kicker. After all that evidence, we're all sitting traumatised, like that, oh, my God. Oh, he's guilty, right? I don't even need to hear any more evidence. That boy's guilty, right? We don't even need to hear... See, Lauren, good morning to you. I'm thinking we don't even need to hear any more evidence. He's guilty as hell. Anyway, his defence lawyer comes in, and do you know what she's talking about? You know, I did go to law school. I went to law school, and then... Um, just use your imaginations, guys. Just, I'm not going to be on here for a while talking. I'm not going to be talking for a while. Um, just use your, keep an open mind and, 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 and use your imagination. And, and I did go to law school. I went to law school here and there. And that, that you know, I studied law. And that was it. That's the defence. We're all gobsmacked, right? So today is day two. So I'm going to be glued to it. Glued to it. I'm going to see the boy's name. I, look, I don't even need to see any more evidence. <laughs> like, you're guilty as hell. It's like, yeah, who does that? The poor mum and dad. And the mum and dad look lovely as well. They look, you know, nice people. Oh, don't you see the name of this, this guy? He's sitting there in the court, too. He's sitting there just... Mm, 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 mm. Chandler Halderson, his name is. Chandler Halderson. But listen, <laughs> yeah. listen it's, going, it's going to get, it's going to get bad because I've seen the law and crime. They won't show us like any pictures and stuff like that that are too graphic. Um, but you will hear the, the testimony, um, like police doctors or whatever they're called. You will hear that. 
Oh, mama's been. <laughs> yeah, oh, Sky, be very careful. Oh, go for girls. See, when you watch it, you need to let me know what you think. The prosecution guy sounds really, really good, right? But wait, I was just like one thing after another after another. We were thinking, what, what horrifying thing is next? What horrifying thing is going to be next? And the, the comment, we were just going, oh my God, we couldn't get over this. That I actually, this actually went down. This is somebody's family. And his, his brother took the stand yesterday. And I felt dead sorry for his brother because his whole family's been wiped out, you know what I mean, in the one day. With this guy. All money, again, all money related. All money, all, all for money. Terrible. He said, he said his mum and dad were at the cabin. Right, they've got this cab. Mum and dad went to this cabin where a strange couple, a strange couple that he didn't know, came and collected mum and dad, right? And he actually helped his mum and dad to pack. This is all the lies he's telling the police. And they said, what, what did you, you help pack for mum and dad? They said, oh, they had a case full of booze and money, right? A booze and money, is the case was full of, right? Jam-packed full of booze and money. But then he told somebody else in the suitcase it was like um, it was like drills and, and equipment to build stuff or, or repair stuff up at the cabin. Mama Spoon, I was I'm not usually shocked with the crime documentaries, right? There's a couple Joe Guy is as well, he was he was one that was shocking. But there's a few that's that's really shocking, like ones with children and stuff like that. Um but a a, a lot of them Although they're, they're horrible and everything like that, I'm not shocked with it. But yesterday, we were all like, oh, we, all can, we all can get over. What, what's next? What is next? And the planning, the guy, they've got them on CCTV footage in like Asda or something like that, buying big bags of ice to put round mum and dad. How can you oh, listen? There's so many hows that there's. I can't go. I can't go. But the fire was. The, the neighbour said they could see the fire like blazing. In July. No, even in Scotland in July, you you've not got your heating on in July, even though it's like rainy and stuff like that. You've not got your heating on. Heating's off in July. He had the fire gone full blast. Full blast. They had a toss. Listen, he'd a measuring tape to measure bits. It's just horrific. This guy needs to... I don't know if this is a um, death penalty trial or not. See, see if it is, then that's what he deserves. I don't even know if the death, death penalty is in that state. What state is it again? W.I. Which state is WI? West Wisconsin? Wisconsin? Was it West Wisconsin? Pip, good morning, Pip. Pip, I'm glad that you didn't hear my story there because you might have been sick. <laughs> I've been watching this, this, oh, this crime document. Well, it's not a documentary, it's a trial just now. Uh, Chandler Holderson, oh my goodness, uh, name. As it was just day one yesterday, it was opening statements and really it was just um, officers that got called to the, um, the house when the parents were missing. Where's mum and dad? Oh, I don't know where mum and they're just missing. Mum and dad are missing. See if I'm ever missing. <laughs> West Constant, yes, that's, that's where it is, Beth. That's where, and I'm pretty sure in that state, in you know, July, you don't need to have your fire on full, full blown. Papa, I'm a bit better today. I went, I managed to go up my swimming, my swimming, but we're, um, we're only allowed up for an hour maximum. And the cold water was off, uh, the hot water was off, so it was only cold water in the showers. Yeah, how's it? Oh, please do, Mama Spoon, please Google it, please Google it. We can, uh, the planning that the, this guy went into and the lies. SpaceX, I was like, SpaceX? See, when they first started seeing this boy was this and that, and I'm going, oh, SpaceX is a dream job. Do you know what I mean? Space, NASA and, and SpaceX, they're absolute dream jobs. 
See if you if you get into NASA or SpaceX, you've got it, mate. He wasn't getting it. Well, I think Elon Musk should take the stand. Just so it's my candy in the courtroom. <laughs> I think Elon Musk should come and take come and take the stand, Elon. Just give me a wee thrilly. Oh, Pip. Uh, but don't think Amanda's costume would fit her now either. I don't think her costume would fit her. So she wouldn't be able to get back out of the pool. See, she went into the pool. She wouldn't be able to get back out. <laughs> We'd need to pull her out the pool. Come on, Amanda. Oh, see, Sky, I'm, I'm dead interested in stuff like that. I watch, I like to watch the trials and stuff like that. As I say, I think I'm turning into a bit of a lawyer. I'm like, objection, or your honour. Your honour, objection to that. Misleading. <laughs> hearsay, your honour, hearsay. Like that. I think I'm quite good at it now. I'm like, uh, I think we all are in the side chat. I mean, it's the same usual people, but you, you get trolls. You still get trolls coming in. You get a lot of trolls. Let's see whose finger's fastest for this one. Let's see whose finger's fastest. Let's see. <laughs> Sky got it. <laughs> Sky, even though you're no well, your finger's still faster than mine. Oh, jiggly babies. Oh my goodness, Pip. Ah, uh, see, that's a sore when they get their feet under your ribs. You're like, oh, baby, push your feeties down. Get your feeties down like this. <laughs> Sky was the fastest. Here, do you know what else the guy done, right? This isn't right. This is questionable. I don't know when this happened, right? This was before the mum and dad incident, right? His brother wasn't well. His brother wasn't well and was in hospital for something, right? And you know when somebody's not well in hospital and things like that, you give them like a get well soon card or something or some grapes or a wee bunch of flowers or something like that. Do you know what he gave his brother? A bullet with get well soon on it. A bullet. I'm questioning that. I'm like, hmm. I would be taking that the wrong way if someone gave me a bullet that would get well soon on it. I'd be like, hmm. You trying to say here? You trying to say? <laughs> uh. It's kind of. Sky got it. Sky's fast. She's fast with the range. So, listen, if you are into lot and crime and stuff like that. Mama Spoon, he's sitting there as if he's an angel boy. He's sitting there in court. Look, look, look he's an angel sitting. There's no defence whatsoever. And see all the, the so far... Or the the um, people that have come up to testify, the defence hasn't even bothered testifying them because there's no a case. I'm wondering why the boy even is wasting money. That's what he's doing because this is, I mean, even for open statements, I'm like, oh my god, the guy's as guilty as hell, and we've not even heard anything yet. Guilty as hell. I mean, they'd found tools, and I'm the one to get into that because I know that he's one. They found a lot of evidence um, that it was him. Him coming out of the bushes, for God's sake. He backed his car into these bushes. That's what he done. And his girlfriend saw him on the GPS or whatever in the uh, next to the river where mum was found. Poor mum. Poor, poor mum and poor dad. Poor family. The, one of the wee neighbours was on and she was, you know, you, you could tell she was holding back the tears. Bloody shame. But the, the web of lies, I was like, my God. Can you imagine? Because I was believing it. Because you think to yourself, who the hell would make up all this kind of stuff? An expert scuba diver teacher. He was he was a teaching folk out scuba dive. Never scuba dived in his life. Never done scuba dive. Oh, he also says that he had all these illnesses. What is it? It's no Munchausen, is it? Munchausen's when you're making yourself ill, isn't it? I'm not sure. But he was saying that he had all these illnesses. He was going to have to get a colostrum bag and, and all this and that. And the neck brace and the brain. He had um, 
he had uh, blood in his brain or something. Nothing. He had none of that. Absolutely none. It just. It, and you know what he done during the day when he was meant to be um, at college? Just sat and played video games. That's all he was doing with his time. And talking to people in Germany. Hmm? In fact, they met a wee pal in Germany. He's going to be called as a witness. A best friend he met. The, the two of them used to just sit during the day and, and uh, play video games and stuff. Listen, I've never heard anything like it. And I've watched a lot. Maybe a hundred trials. I've watched loads of trials and serial killer dot but this one honest to god is just oh, i can't i can't wait for today's um i can't wait for today what time will it come on round about let me think what time was that yesterday mm. about two or three in the afternoon it will come on here probably three um that'll be me all night watching it Forensics is fascinating to me as well. I would have loved a job like that. I'd have really loved a, a job like that. It's a dead interesting job. Um, so, but uh, look, I've turned into a bit of a lawyer. I think I should. I think I should uh, open a wee shop or something. You know, like like Lucy or uh, Charlie Brown. <laughs> I should. I should make a wee kiosk thing there like that and. And, and have, um, it'll be like Better Call Saul, I'll just have lots of neck braces and stuff like that. Oh, you're napped. Pip, that's good, you've got a nap time, because um, you need your energy, you need to, you need to build your energy up. It's not going to be long now, and it's the same with my man, it's not going to be long. Can't wait. Cannot wait. So it was good getting up my swimming. I enjoyed that this morning, my wee swim. Shame about the hot water, because I, I love my shower. It's a, it's, you know, I've got just a normal shower. Their shower's a big, beautiful shower. Um, freezing, freezing cold. So I don't know what's happening with their boiler. They need to get that fixed, so they do. I know, Pip, it could be here any time, the Baba. The Baba could be here any time, I can't wait. What I'm going to do is see the cot in my bedroom. I'm going to move it to the bottom of my bed. The now it's at the side of my bed, but see, uh, being at the side of the bed, see if there's anything like a C A T out the the back. The dogs are jumping up on it like this, so I won't be having the dogs jumping up on the cot. So I'll need to move it so it's at the bottom of my bed. So that space there is going to give me more space to get a new unit for makeup. <laughs> I'm already planning it in my head. I'm thinking of nice new units that I can... Because I've got makeup that needs to put away. I'm needing more room. <laughs> I'm thinking I can put a nice unit there. That's what I can do with all this makeup. I know it does fly. You see, when you're going through it, though, you think, oh, God, it's such a long time. But, but it, it's not really. Grandbabies. She's, what, 36 weeks... 36 weeks she is. So not long now. She's she's fed up though. She's starting to get swelling, she said. She's her hands and her feet are starting to swell. And she's not even allowed to lounge back like that. She's got to sit forward like this so that the wee fella's head turns. So she's not even been able to get comfortable or anything like that. So she is really fed up. It's my craft video. Good morning or good evening to you. Thank you for coming in. So, um, I should say... Uh, and people keep saying to her, enjoy your sleep just now because you won't get any when the baby's born. She's not getting any sleep the now. <laughs> she she can't get to sleep the now. <laughs> I know, I oh know. Oh, it's a shame. I remember I couldn't wait to I, I lay on my belly because sometimes when I'm in bed, I like to lie on my belly like that way. With one leg kind of up, one leg down, just lie like this. Um, and, I, and I used to want to do that when I was pregnant. Obviously you can't. You've got the huge big belly, the big baby in the belly. But it won't be long now. Dead excited. 
excited and worried. You know, I mean, the, the worries there as well. There always will be. Um, excited and worried as well. Just hoping. I know, February's almost here. I would like her to go on the 2nd of the 2nd, 22. That would be a great birthday. Open minded, my lovely open mind. Good morning, good morning. I feel good. I'm just after telling a horrific story. <laughs> He's came in at the right time. <laughs> I'm not going to go back over it though. <laughs> I've already made everybody feel sick this morning. Job done. <laughs> I've been watching this trial on, what's the guy's name? I always forget the guy's bloody name. What's his name? Chandler Holderson. Chandler Holderson. Uh -huh. Do you know, it's still a bit sore open-minded, but I can move around like that. It's sore when I move it, but it's, it's not as bad as what it was yesterday, that's for sure. Yesterday it was terrible. Yesterday I was walking a bit like that. <laughs> but I just sat and I rubbed my udder mint. I had my udder mint and I rubbed that all into the side of my I just kept doing that and thinking, God, Aqua I bet you Aquaman could give you a right good neck massage, eh? See if Aquaman was here I'd be forgetting all about the neck, I can assure you. <laughs> the neck would be the last thing I'd be thinking. <laughs> oh yeah, open mind it. Oh no, but what's going on with the phone? What's going on with the bloody phone again? See this? I've got three new chargers coming. Three new chargers coming to stop this shenanigans. It's because I'm going to run out of power again. <sighs> Pip, when do, when do you finish, finish now? Surely you'll be finishing soon and then you can just relax. Yeah, the phone's doing it again, Sky. It's doing it again. But the, the new charger's got a big, big, long wire, so I can plug these into the, the mains. See, the new these are plugged into the laptop, and it's just no charging. 21st of January, Pitbull. That's not too long away. And then you can sit with your feet up. As it's, it's when, last year did go in pretty fast when I think about it. I think there was just so much going on last year. Um, I've got a good feeling about 2022, though. I think good things for all of us. Good things for everyone in the chat. And if you're watching afterwards, good thing for you as well. Will you miss your work, Pip? Well, it won't be long and you'll have the wee and then... You'll just have no time for anything. I remember having cups of coffee lying all about the house that hadn't been touched because I'd make myself a cup of coffee and then the, the one of them would start crying or something and I would need to go and feed the baby and there was always cups of coffee all over the place that, that hadn't been drank. Well, anyway, I'm going to have to go because this phone's at it again. But listen, watch that. If you're into that, watch the, the crime documentary. I'm absolutely, I'm stunned with watching this. Oh, my God. Well, things are going to get better. I can feel things. And if you've got any kind of pain, get on the phone and get in. Um, yes, it goes in quickly. So anyway, guys, I love you all very, very much. And I'll be back tomorrow to see you. And uh, I'll be watching that. I'll be see if he's on the Lawn Crime Channel this afternoon. I'll be there as well, typing away the chat. Objection, Your Honour. Objection. <laughs> so I love you all very much, and I'm going to give you all a big kiss now. Thank you so much for coming in.